Welcome YouTubers to another video. Uh, I have a ROM installation that I would like to share with y'all. Uh, it's called the AOSP Project or ProBAM ROM. Uh, really unique ROM here at XDA. I'll send a link down below. Uh, as you scroll down here on the original post, this ROM here, you got your download now latest stable release you got a couple videos but they're not videos for the Nexus 7 2013 edition so today I'd like to run this by you so you get an option uh, a chance to check this out on a Nexus 7 2013 uh, so let's get started I've already clicked download and I've downloaded what I needed I've also downloaded the the GApps package it says install from here okay I've already gotten that so let's go ahead and take a look at our file explorer. ES File Explorer, really great. Yeah, I use it all the time. It's great for navigating through files. So let's go over here to download. Let's go to my ROMs. I've got several of them to do, but we're going to focus on AOSB. I've got it right here. So let's go ahead and restart. We're actually going to reboot into recovery. Yes. All right. And while this is happening, I like to talk about all of these ROMs are going to be done through multi-ROM. Multi-ROM is a once again, it's a really awesome uh, addition. Kind of like it's like a hack that just while this is booting up, it gives you the option to choose whatever ROMs you have downloaded to boot from which is great when you want to try something out and you're not quite sure if you like it or not. So it gives you an option to go ahead and put that on there, be play around with it for a little bit, see if you like it. If you like it, go ahead and make it your norm, your 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 daily driver. But okay, so now we're here. We'll go to advanced. See multi-ROM is right there. Multi-ROM. We're going to see what I've got over here. All right, I don't have it yet. So we're going to go ahead and add a ROM keep your Android that's the ROM type I want to use I don't want to share the kernel it's coming from my internal memory let's go to next I want to grab a zip for that let's go up a level to AOSP you always want to do the main zip file and then the G apps afterwards let's go ahead and flash that Bam. alright we'll let this roll through for just a second Next seven is really, uh, really quick on this. Loads it within a reasonable amount of time. You're not sitting here waiting for 10, 15, 20 minutes for something to load for you to turn it, you know, to boot into it, and it just doesn't look like something you would like to even mess with. So, and it's about complete. Updating my partition details. Here we go. Instead of rebooting, we want to go back, go back again. We want to list our ROMs. Here's my AOSB flow. Boom. We want to flash a zip. Okay, we want to flash G apps or Google apps there. So we're going to flash that. And I'll come right, but this may take about two or three minutes perhaps to scroll through so I'll come right back okay I'm back again and it's about to finish up there we go now I'm gonna go ahead and reboot system sometimes when you load a, a ROM for its first time it may take a little bit so you just gotta be patient let it sit for a while before you start messing around with it alright here's where your multi-rom kicks in all these different roms I have downloaded I can check any one of them I want and do whatever I want with each one of them it's really awesome but today we're gonna do AOSP flow and I'm booting from there so let's check it out if you're all curious anyone is curious the unlock down there is you know when you unlock your bootloader your phone or your device through well look at this 
pretty neat. Bootloaders are, or excuse me, um, your boot animations are really awesome. I kind of like it. Sometimes I like to just turn it on and set it aside, and as people scroll, you know, look over at your desk or something like that, they kind of see your phone loading up and get a few comments about, you know, what is that? Where'd you get that from? Like, oh, it's a custom ROM, and of course they have no idea what I'm talking about, and so I spend a few minutes trying to explain to them what I mean, and uh, usually it goes right over them, just like it did to me several months back, and I just spent the time to read up on this and uh, see how you know how this operates and I, I was intrigued by it and really enjoy it so I want to bring some of this um, to you hopefully it will inspire one of y'all to do the same thing I mean I'm not that not a, you know super pro at it or anything though but at least I can give you some of the aspects to this and so I'll come right back after it's done loading it may take just a few minutes okay and we're back nice fresh welcome screen English. Uh, we're not going to worry about internet at the moment. I'm just going to go ahead and skip that. Skip anyway. I don't want any of this to start happening. Date and time, you can figure that out yourself. Um, Google services. Yep. Alright, set up complete and finish. Okay, here we go. Standard welcome. Make yourself at home. Sure will. Okay, optimize your space. Okay, nice cool little AOSP logo. Project BAM, pretty nice. All right. Well, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go ahead and check out settings. Well, they got a nice little character sitting there in the gear. AOSP in black, always love that. Animation control, you can click on that. You can change your system. You're scrolling. Lots of wow. Lots of different things that you can shoo. I might make this my daily driver. This is really awesome. Alright, you got your of course your themes. You can download those as you see fit. Uh interface. Wow. Screen recorder. Recents RAM bar, heck yeah. Yeah, you can adjust colors, that's really awesome. Custom progress bar, omni switch. Your app, man, there's a lot of stuff you can do on this. This is really good. I like it. Let's go down here. Wow, there's even more stuff here under the device. Launch music app. Yeah, your profiles, you got all your good stuff there, the nat normal stuff. Performance about, you know, I like the performance. That's really cool. Proceed with caution, caution, definitely. But that's cool that you can go ahead and change that stuff on the fly. It's pretty nice. And then, of course, your super user about tablet. That's great. Android version 2, 4.4.2. Memory, AOSB KitKat version. Let's see if. Ah, look at that. Bam. That's pretty neat. All right. And let's see if any of this others. Ooh, CyanogenMon. Pretty nifty. That's pretty cool. All right. Anything else? Okay, that's what we're used to. Okay. All right. Pretty cool little thing. You can play around with most of these and see if any of these others do anything cool. But I really like this. These are a lot of options, and definitely, you know, you you're left pretty much with a blank slate here to do what you wish. Apps. Pretty much the standard G apps package here, um, including your super user, uh, whisper push, pretty sweet. OTAs over the air, that's pretty neat. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, was that a grenade? Oh, well, anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this video and found this ROM very interesting. I'll have the link down below. It's really Interest. I, I like this one out, out of most of the ones I've looked at, but I'll put more up there for y'all to view and stuff. So take care. Thank you for watching.